Hey guys, so all of you know that we use WhatsApp almost every day. Wow. And sending messages on WhatsApp typically requires you to save numbers. And there are times when you want to send messages to people without saving their contact numbers. And I'm sure you're wondering that how you can send messages without saving the contact numbers. But don't worry because in this video, I'm going to be telling you four methods by which you can do that. Alright. So this is Anju Sharma and you're watching Geeky Fight. So without wasting any time, let's first hit the intro. Alright, so the first method is to use WhatsApp directly. So once you've opened WhatsApp, just tap on this chat icon here and here tap on search. Now just add the number to whom you want to send the message. But there's a prerequisite that you have to remember the number and if you don't remember the number, just look at any place where you've already saved the number or you have it in a different place. But anyway, let's just type out the number and just tap on search. And if the number that you've typed is already on WhatsApp, it will start to show that this number is here and it's not in your contacts. And here at the top right, you'll see the option of chat. Just tap on it. And now you can easily send this person a message without saving their number. So just send hi. Now let's say for some reason, this feature is not working in your WhatsApp. Then there's another way as well. So again, just tap on the chat icon here. And now you have to select your own name from the contact list. So what you have to do is just paste the number to whom you want to send the message to. So let's do that. And then send the number to yourself and just tap on it. And once you tap on it, it will start to show the option of chat with this number so that you can start a conversation. So just tap here. And then again, it will show the chat section where you can send the message, whatever you want to send. So this method is very effective for casual messaging without cluttering your contact list. All right, the another method is to generate a web link. So let me show you how you can do that. So on your phone, just open any browser. I'm gonna open Chrome. And here you have to type the following URL that will be shown in the screen in the same format. So just add that URL in the address bar. And of course, you have to replace the phone number section with your own phone number to whom you want to send the message. Also, make sure that you have added the country code as well. Otherwise, this will not work. And now just press enter to access the link. And then WhatsApp will open a chat window for that number. So you just have to click continue to chat to begin messaging with the same number. And again, the same chat section is opened and now you can begin messaging without any problem of saving the content. So this method is pretty useful for those people who use WhatsApp in their desktop and laptop without installing the WhatsApp app for desktop. But anyway, this method suits both mobile and desktop users. All right, the third method is to use the Truecaller app. So Truecaller also offer a feature to send message directly via the app. So what you have to do is just open the Truecaller app and in the search bar, search for the desired number. So let's add that infamous number and just search for the desired number. And once Truecaller has identified the number and the identity, at the bottom, you'll see the option of WhatsApp. So the same number is also on WhatsApp. You'll also get to see in the Truecaller app at the bottom here. So just tap on WhatsApp and again the same screen has been opened where you can chat with this person. So this option is also very easy and it's convenient for all those people who use Truecaller frequently. And yes, you don't need the premium version of Truecaller for it to work. All right, last in the fourth method is to use Google Assistant for your Android devices. As Google Assistant simplifies the process even more. So on your Android device, just launch Google Assistant by saying, hey Google, or by pressing the power button. And then you just have to command to Google Assistant, send a WhatsApp to plus nine one. What's the message? Hey boy. How are you? I got it. Hey boy, how are you? Ready to send it? Yes, send this message. So this hands-free method with the help of Google Assistant helps those people who prefer to use voice commands more than their fingers. Alright, these were the four best methods by which you can send WhatsApp messages without saving a contact number. So do let me know in the comment section which is your favorite method and how do you like this video. It was perfect. Everything. Down to the last minute details. And if you've reached here, then definitely like this video, share it with your friends and family. And also don't forget to subscribe to our channel that is Geekified. With that, I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, keep enjoying your life. Let me also enjoy my life. See ya, bye-bye. Thank you.